time for an update on the Baja bug. Been a while. Tell you where she's at. Figured I'd start at the front. Hopefully my memory's good. Might not be. Baja Design Squadron. I think they're just sports. Nothing big for lights. Um, front end is definitely not Volkswagen anymore. Um, I bought a lower boxed A-arm kit from Nichols Fab. I think they're in Tucson. It's been a while. Uh, with two inch hollow hubs. Um, it lock to lock, it's 19 inches, but I haven't limited to 18, so I don't beat stuff up. Um, RBP brakes, um, they're out of Anaheim, California. Good stuff. Uh, let's see, Willwood calipers, four piston. Um, I got Fox 2.0 by 10 coil over and bypass two tube um not totally dialed in yet but spring rate wise yes valving could use some work um my buddy matt black did this sweet 80s inspired wrap well the car is white so from the from the black down um his shops in Costa Mesa, American Rim Supply in Carlsbad are the wheels. Um, I think the front is 16 by four, if I remember correctly, to get some tall skinnies. Um, they're, are they 235, 85, 16? They're like dually rear tires, but I wanted something tall and skinny that were BFGs. That's all I could find, so I had some 16 inch wheels made. The rear's 33, 10, 5, 0. Same RBP uh, brakes, micro stubs. Um, I have a 2.5 by 12 Fox coilover. Um, remote reservoirs and some overkill 2.5 by 14 four tube bypasses Fox, also remote, remote reservoir. Um, rear arms are three by five. I think the axles are somewhere like 21 and a half inches or something. Chromoly, um, still running a bus box with close third and fourth Weddell. Um, I think it's still stock ring and pinion. I haven't been inside that sucker in a long time. Uh, Honda. I swapped out the turbo motor for a Honda uh, three liter out of a it was out of a 2001 Accord um, Kennedy Stage Two pressure plate stock clutch well stock style clutch disc figured that would be my fusible link to not blow the trans up um, Dave at Hothead Headers. Um, made the exhaust. I had it dual at, uh, dual outlet at first, but it sounded like junk. It sounded like a boat out of water. Not his fault though. That's how I wanted him. And then um, use these same like stainless silencers. And I brought it back, and we did this X pipe. It's kind of hard to see. So uh, with the X pipe, it's way better, a million times better. Um, Awesome eBay freaking radiator, uh, XJ from a Jeep Cherokee. Works perfect. Three fans. The center one's on all the time. Uh, the outer two come on with the thermostat, the factory Honda thermostat. I'm running factory ECU right now. Um, CarTech carbon scoop help with cooling. You can see my radiator overflow bottle and then my fuel fill. It has a 25 gallon fuel safe cell in it I think you can see down here so it lasts a long time tons of miles on this sucker motors totally bone stock minus the exhaust and the air filter um, yours from Cartech rear limit straps oh, all limit straps are from Cartech bunch of stuff from Cartech but yeah that's her in the moment
at the moment. Um, it's the interior. Steering wheel pops off. Dash is a little old. I bought the car with the dash already in it. Um, the rear suspension right now cycles. I have it strapped at 16 inches. And I could probably get a little more droop out of it, but I don't want to push the CVs. It already rides pretty good. And I have uh, electric power steering also. Um, I think it's affordable power steering. I think it's from a Saturn view or something, but power steering's down here. All CNC pedals, can't get them anymore, hanging pedals. That's the power steering I put in. Um, adjustable, race radio, all your comms, older stuff. But she's fun. And most importantly, still street legal. It's the best part. That'll do it for now.